Tom was always down at the ground if we were playing at Sapphire Gardens, always had a bat in his hand and when he got awarded a contract uh, at Glamorgan I was, I was hugely uh, proud to, to think that we'd never see him again, it was horrendous. We went down to West Wales to a friend's caravan and, and had a few days down there and just wandered um, down the beach in Tembe and down the track, just trying to comprehend actually what had happened. But what are the options? The options are drastic, you know? The, the options are you, you consider taking your own life. In the morning, I was upstairs. My daughter knocked on the door and, Dad, Dad, come down, the, the police are here. And uh, they told us that there'd been an accident and that Tom was dead. And, uh, and they were very blunt about it. It was on the news channel, so it was on, on TV, and obviously very soon everyone knew about it. He, he was loved by so many. He was so close, so thoughtful. You see who your true friends are, if you like, um, uh, at, at those times, those people who are there who, I don't know, but they seem to just listen. Alcohol. Um, helped, I suppose. The effect it's had is probably, I don't know, learning to cope, I suppose, and, and learning to manage with what we've been through. You learn over time to deal with it. There is so much happening. It's not just about the, the per, one person who was affected who played cricket, but the Benevolent Fund look after the, the whole family. and. You've got to speak, you, you, you need to talk, you need an avenue of communication and, and the PCA helpline is very valuable in that. Just to talk as I found out, you know, speaking to a counsellor uh, about Tom, it, it helps, it, it, it really helps you get things off your chest, very beneficial uh, at that time and, and continues to be. You still very much have dark days, but I know that there is still, I can pick up the phone and speak to Brian should I, I need to. He'll be there for me. I fell out of love with cricket, but through the PCA Benevolent Fund, I got that love back. I got that want to help people again. You want to help people become the best cricketers, but also the, the best people they can be as well. And that wouldn't have happened without the help and support of the PCA Benevolent Fund.